Did you know that Boeing saved over $3 million from adapting 3D printing for titanium parts? Hi everyone, welcome to our channel. And today we're gonna make 3D printed ways. So before we start, I would like to thank you for all the support and likes from you. And please subscribe because soon we're gonna have raffle where you can win a filament from our channel. We're going to do raffle every month. So just make sure you hit that subscribe button to don't miss out your chance to win. Okay, now let's get started with our modeling. So we're going to open our Fusion 360 and make new component with the name vase. Then we're going to create a sketch that will define the shape of our vase. Then we're gonna extrude our shape approximately 150 millimeters with six front faces. Then from modify drop down list we will choose fill hole function. Fill hole mode we need to choose collapse and tick maintain crease edges. Then simply double click on the line and press edit form. We will drag and drop and modify our shape according to our needs. When the shape is ready, we press finish form and choose thicken from create drop down menu. In this case, I will use one and a half millimeters for thickness and our vase is ready. Then from the file drop down menu, we choose 3D print and we choose our printer and press OK. In Cura, we need to find special modes and tick spiralize outer contour. Also, I suggest to thick smooth spiralized contours and we are ready for the print. Turned out very beautiful. Let's remove this rim. We can file the edges. For that I use my wife's nail filer. Perfect. Now all what we have to do is just insert the flowers and that's how it's going to look like. If you want, you can spray with uh, some black. So that's what I did. I just sprayed inside the black color. It's just started to go through all these curves and it's now sit on the bottom. But look how amazing it looks with all these black colors inside. It's just amazing. For those who haven't subscribed, please subscribe and have a great print. 